All right, so I got my new air filter. There's the part number. Here's the instructions. So now all I have to do is plug here on the air filter cover and remove this cover. side, pull off your cover, set that aside, and here's the filter, there's a seal in there, and then you can see that's the original Harley-Davidson part number, yeah it's a little filthy, a little higher quality air filter than the paper filter replacement that I picked up. Maybe I'll clean it up, blow it out, save it, use it later, maybe not. Alright, so there's my carburetor. Uh, the instructions say to clean this plate inside here of any debris and stuff, so I'll get a rag, wipe that down, and get ready to install the, the new air filter. Okay, now that you removed the air filter, you want to take a look and you want to use these breather hoses. So go ahead and pull those off of your existing air cleaner and uh, inspect those for any type of cracks or anything like that. Make sure they're reusable, uh, otherwise replace them. So I'm going to go ahead and pull these off, pull some air through them, clean them up, and reinstall them onto that one. Okay, so pretty simple. I uh, took the breather hoses off, cleaned them out with Hushopi water, and then dried them off and then I used Armor All cleaner on both the air cleaner seal as well as the breather tubes. I blew air through them, made sure there were no cracks or anything, and that they were completely serviceable. Um, so now I'm just going to reinstall, which just want to make sure you get it put up here, get your breather tubes lined up with that point there in this point here where the breather holes are uh, get it installed and I'll show you what that looks like okay so I ended up taking a chrome polisher and rust removal this turtle wax here to both the inside and outside of the air cleaner especially where that seal was because that seal had somewhat deteriorated from a little bit of gas and uh, debris and everything in there so I needed to clean up that container pretty well in order to reattach the seal and to uh, let the seal reseat and everything without the gummy residue of the the rubber that's on there now so I got the air filter installed the breather tubes connected to their respective areas and now I just need to reinstall the outside cover like so and get the fit up there and screw it down. Okay, it's highly critical and important that you ensure that that seal adheres well all the way around the air filter to avoid any leaks or debris getting in there, but also uh, you don't want your air filter cover rattling as you're riding down the road. Uh, tighten that bolt down to spec. I believe this has in here three to five foot pounds is what the uh, the tightening needs to be for torque. So go ahead and put the torque and that's it. Thank you for watching.